being overheated and not having a way to cool yourself off. That's the case for many pets throughout our area. Victoria Idoni tagged along with the Humane Society today, checking on dogs that people called in concerned about. A stray animal can usually find their way to water or at least some shade. The trouble is animals that are stuck in someone's yard often don't have that luxury. In this heat, that can turn a tough situation into a tragic one if nothing is done. If there's three violations right off the bat, then I'll usually remove the animal. Um, that to me indicates the person doesn't care, the owner. So this dog here basically has flies all over his ear. He's not being treated for that. There's no water. Um, it's like eight, gonna be 90 degrees out today. Hungry? And he's very skinny. So that's actually four problems there. So I'm gonna remove him right now. And the owner's not home. So we're gonna get him into a safe place. If your dog does start to draw flies when they're outside, that's not out of the ordinary. Uh, the main issue I see is the flies on the dog's ears, constantly biting at the ears, and that's going to be normal around this time of year, um, just due to the temperature and all the rain that we had, the moisture. Officer Boros says flies can be torture for a dog, but a quick trip to the pet store to get dog-specific fly spray will solve the problem. If you do have an outside animal or one that has to be out there for more than just a few minutes at a time, water that can't get knocked over is vitally important. Regular bowl won't, will not last a dog in this kind of weather, so you want to definitely put something that is big enough that's going to last for the period of time that it is outside. Um, and I recommend um, like a bucket. Um, if the dog tears it up or plays with it or something, you always attach it to the fence with like a clip or something, or you can dig a hole around the size of the bucket and just put it down in there. The cruelty officers will be working extra shifts over this hot weekend. If you see something, don't hesitate to call the Humane Society. From Central Toledo, Victoria Idoni, WTOL 11.